And hello from Germany's Autostadt, the motor city, Wolfsburg. This is the scene here at the Volkswagen Arena. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary box, and I'm joined for commentary by Lee Dixon. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It is Wolfsburg facing RB Leipzig. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Real pleasure to be here. Looking forward to this game. Players will be a bit nervous. I was always nervous at the start of games. It's important you get your first pass off to your colleague, maybe get a good tackle in, settle the nerves down. Looking forward to a good game here. And so the starting lineup for Wolfsburg. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. And let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Peter Gulacci is the goalkeeper of choice. Kevin Kamper plays alongside Marcel Zabitzer in central midfield. And as for the attack, well, it has a bold look about it with three forwards listed from the beginning. And the match is underway. Jérôme Roussillon. It's a good-looking ball in behind. A chance for Philip, And the keeper stretching to deny him. So the corner played into the box. Last man back and job done. Can he put them ahead? Offside the decision. Leipzig so very well drilled and organised at the back and it usually takes something special to pierce their defence league. Well, Derek, I used to speak to the away fans at Arsenal and they always used to say to me they felt really confident on the road because we didn't concede goals. There was always a chance, always a sniff of an away day three-pointer. And in with a real chance. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. And taken short. That's someone to play it to. An example of how to press. Good pressure high up the pitch. Difficult to stop him. Good idea, that particular move, but not to be. Brekalo. On to Weghorst. And it's with Brekalo here. Can he play it in? Well, the cross played over, but ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Well, they're doing a fine job of applying pressure here, not giving their opponents time to think or get out of their own half. Arnold. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. Not a good pass. Paulsen might be able to produce from this position. In behind for him to chase. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Can he find someone at the far post? Classy goalkeeping. Well, it was a good save from the goalkeeper, but you'd expect him to make that save, wouldn't you? Brekalo. 
Now Philip. Brecalo. And the cross goes in. Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Emil Forsberg. The ball with Kampel. Angelino. Forsberg. And a throw in it's going to be. Arnold. Now potential danger. Well, wasted opportunity here. Would have been a decent chance, but offside the verdict. Leipzig enjoying the bulk of possession here, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. And a fine cross. Well, he's elected to tip that over for the corner. Well, a chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. Teammates available. Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. No high quality defending. No danger here as he runs at them. Camper. The referee knew that was foul play, but after the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. He's going to have a go here. Well, suffice it to say, that wasn't a high-quality free kick. No, practice makes perfect. I think he's had a week off. There will be one minute added on at the end. Baku, room to manoeuvre on the wing. Opportunity to take the lead. And there it is, the breakthrough. That will do nicely. Well, this is worth another look, Derek. Lovely movement and guile to easily evade the defender. There's still a lot of work to be done, but the keeper presents the near post on a plate and he's punished. That's quite remarkable. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Marcel Zabitza. Paulsen. It might be on for them. And a chance to whip it in here. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Crossing into the middle. Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique, really, and the goalkeeper's not troubled. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. I've got to say, he landed really heavily on his shoulder there and looks like he's in severe pain. <laughs> and the alarm bells are ringing. It wasn't far away from the target, Lee. No, it was decent. Really, really decent chance for the lad. They'll keep pushing away to try and get that equaliser. Brooks. Successfully cut out. Oh, showing excellent vision. And he's found a bit of daylight. 
And unfortunate with that, Chip Lee, just over the top. Oh, he's done everything right. He's gone over the keeper, but unfortunately, he's gone over the bar as well. Half an hour remaining then. It is a decent looking attack here. Excellent block. What a corner kick it is. Let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage. Over it comes. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. The hosts really haven't had too much of the ball, but to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit... Well, only just wide of the post. And they're making a change. Marcel Zabitza. Emil Forsberg. Untidy in possession. Just too much on that pass. And by a wafer-thin margin, offside. Marcel Zabitza. Not a particularly strong challenge. Couldn't quite hang on. Well, nothing untoward happened. Counter-attacking, very much an option. They need to get bodies back. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back and then through on goal. Do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, a second goal for them here. That's a good-looking ball. No, high quality defending. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Real chance. That is top notch goalkeeping. He had to reach in with his hand. Yeah, it's all about reading the pace of the ball and the player's feet. When do I go down? When do I strip the ball? Did a brilliant job then. Mukiele. Wang He Chan. Dangerous looking attack. Well, they have it again. Well, he's given it away. Forsberg. He takes aim. The save was a good one. It's a corner. And now the delivery. Well, they couldn't get the header on the target, but robust defending. So, well, wasted opportunity here. Would have been a decent chance, but offside the verdict. Emil Forsberg. Wang Hee-chan. 
and continues his run can he get one back oh did so well to deny him well he's given a corner they referee played into the center of the box so that will be all for this game and a bad day at the office for Leipzig you've got to say three points squandered Lee well in today's evidence it's really hard to see how they've got a defensive record so tight separated fractured no communication and that's just me and you Derek the back line was just the same an absolute shambles